Nearly anyone who has played Minecraft has swung a sword to kill enemies or injure players. But what about using a sword in real life to control their character? I wanted to build a Minecraft sword that when swung could make the sword on their player move as well. I started by designing the sword in Fusion 360 by inserting an attached canvas and then sketching around the design by making lines. Then I extruded it and scaled it to where the length of the sword was around 27.8 centimeters. Lastly, I divided it into a blade and a handle. In order to cut out the sword design, I used my CNC router. After gathering a couple sheets of quarter inch plywood, it was time to cut. After, I sanded two pieces and put them on some foam for a template and used a jigsaw to route out the parts. I then sandwiched the foam pieces in between the plywood. Well, after 25 minutes of milling, my PCB is finally completed. So here it is. Uh, it turned out pretty well. So the ESP12E can go right in here. There's all the solder paste put on. So I'm going to go ahead and add the ESP12E. Make sure it's oriented the correct way in them. Very carefully align it. Just align it and place it down. Perfect. Just like that. Okay, so here is the PCB with all the surface mount parts added onto it, with solder paste connecting it. And I have my heat gun right here that I will now use to melt it. Okay, so here I am with all of the uh, Minecraft sheep in the flat world. I have my new sword right here that I will now use to uh, dispatch of them. Quite humanely though. <laughs> so as you can see, if I come over here, whenever I swing it, it'll also swing. So let's go over here. So you can see that now the sheep are beginning to die. 